Hey guys, welcome to my channel. So today I have a collective message. We're going to find out what we're wanting to hear. Please remember this when it resonates for everyone. So let's get straight into this and find out what we're wanting to know. Okay, whoever I'm speaking to, um, somebody's shocked, you're dealing with somebody that seems to be very shocked here, now, I don't know who's in, in, but you seem to have broke this person's ego down, right, like, you killed it, you destroyed it, and this person was somebody that had a massive ego, right? Somebody that was very sure of themselves. Um, this person, they kind of are giving me an energy where they really loved themselves. Um, this person really thought that they were attractive, okay? Like, this person thought that they were more attractive than anyone else did, okay? Like, this person loved themselves more than, like, anyone else did. Like, this person, it kind of gives me this, like very cocky energy, okay, very egotistic energy, for some of you this could be a narcissist, okay, you could have been dealing with a narcissist, but whew, did you break their ego, like, did you kill this person's ego, like, this person went from really, really sure of themselves to I don't know, this person's kind of anxious, they feel like they're breaking down at the moment. They kind of feel like this person's a little bit worried to, like, confront people, or... It's like you took somebody that was very cocky, very over-the-top, okay, very, like, sure of themselves, and now they seem to be kind of nervous, kind of shy, okay, very self-conscious, um, they have this wall up, okay, I'm kind of getting that, there's this energy of this person, they feel like, they're like really shocked here, okay, now I'm getting that, I keep hearing unexpected, it feels like, they were not expecting you, okay? When you came into this person's life, they were not expecting you at all. In fact, this person, um, this is the type of person that plays games with people. They also, they feel like they can get into people's heads, okay? Kind of feels like this person, I don't know, like they play games, they try to get into people's heads. Like, I just think 333, three, three. this person, they may be very attractive, either way they think that they're really attractive themselves and they think that they can get whatever they want just because they're attractive or they're confident or they're charming. But I'm kind of getting that this person really just came off and very cocky. Um, now I'm not sure what happened to you but there's an energy of you dressing this person out. Um, this person kind of tried to play some type of game with you or get inside your head and it didn't work, okay? I'm kind of getting an energy where this person tried to make you fall in love with them or make you fall for them, but it kind of feels like a trap, like it, it kind of feels like them setting you up, right? But the thing is, this person, again, they did not expect you, right? Whoever I'm speaking to, you seem to be somebody that you definitely speak your mind, you're definitely very intelligent, you always know what to say and when to say it. Then a very intelligent energy to whoever I'm speaking to. I'm also getting that you're able to read through people, right? 
I'm kind of getting an energy where whoever I'm speaking to, um, you really analyze people, you analyze situation, um, you're really able to read energy, like you're very accurate at reading energy, okay? Now, then also this like very detached energy to you, but I'm getting this energy of you kind of like being able to see through this person's mind game and this person, they were playing mind game, right? And I'm getting this energy of this person kind of feels like them trying to get into your head, but then it feels like you think through this person, um, kind of feels like, again, you just think through this person, you seem to be able to see through people, like, crystal clear, right? You have a crystal clear intuition, right? And this person, they really tried to play game here with you, but kind of getting this energy of you being one step ahead, at all time, right? This person, they tried to get into your head, but instead it's like you got into their head, right? And you may not have even realized this, but they were trying to get into your head. And because their tactic or these mind games weren't working, this person dressed and now it's like, they're literally confused, right? Like you have this person confused, you have this person, again, they were so sure of themselves. They thought that they could really get what they want by basically manipulating people. And I'm getting that you kind of shut that down for them. Whoever you're dealing with, they really feel like that they can outsmart people, right? But it's like they think that they can outsmart people by manipulating people. Didn't work with you, okay? This person, they seem to be kind of angry and whoa. You've got this person really shocked, right? This person cannot believe how intelligent you are. I'm getting that there's this energy where this person really respects you. They also love how, I'm kind of getting this energy of you being a little bit detached, right? They really love that and they look up to that, to be honest, right? I'm getting that this person, they also, when they first met you, they made a lot of assumptions about you, like, they really thought you were somebody... So they thought that you may have been maybe gullible or a little bit naive or something like that. They realize that they're very wrong and they also realize that they cannot outsmart you, right? And this person, I just need 818, this person, um, they have this thing where they feel like they can outsmart anyone but they tried it with you and it just did not work. I'm also getting this energy of you kind of hurting person like maybe you rejected this person or something but I'm kind of getting that you broke this person's heart right and this person when you met them they were so like they gave off a little bit of a player energy but then they met you and I'm getting that they fell in love with you but then you broke their heart right like, I'm getting this energy of them getting to know you and basically falling in love with you. But again, I'm getting this energy of... It's kind of like they were trying to play games with you, right? So it's not like they expressed their emotions or anything like that. Like, they had feeling here for you or they have feeling here for you. But they don't seem to want to express them. They seem to be trying to play games with you. Um, they also keep trying to get into your head. It kind of feels like this person wants you to chase them. The fact that this person cannot get to you, it really bothers them, right? And I'm kind of getting this energy of them. They keep trying to work on getting your attention. But again, it kind of feels like 
you don't even know the thin person or it feels like this person feels like you don't notice them okay or you don't care about them um again it kind of feels like this energy where this person they try to get into your head but instead they're stressing over you you also have this person unable to get over you i'm getting this energy where they constantly think about you, right? They also feel like there's no one like you. Like, they love this. They feel like you're very independent. They feel like... They're like this loving and caring energy to you. But then once you detach and once you're done, like, that's it, right? Like, you literally seem to get over things very quickly. That's how they feel. This person, it's like they watch you and this person feels like they can't get over you. They can't even sleep, to be honest. Right? There's this energy as well where this person, they're having a hard time keeping their emotion in check here, right? Like, usually this person, they're not really into their emotions, but I'm getting with you. You really bring out these emotions and they're having a hard time controlling them but with you they feel like you're so detached like they feel like you don't even care or like you know you don't show any emotion almost right even though you seem to be like such a loving and caring person it's like then this energy like a poker face like this person cannot read you, and I'm getting that this person tried, but they cannot read you. It's interesting because this person also thinks that... They feel like that it's like you're hiding your feelings for them, or something like that. Like, for some of you, you don't really seem to be interested in this person. But they won't take that, okay? They feel like you're lying. Like, they feel like you actually do like them, like... Could be dealing with a Leo. Could be dealing with a Taurus. It's so interesting. This person, they may actually... They keep coming back and I'm getting that they keep trying to get your attention. I'm getting that they're about to come back. Um... They're about to express their emotion for you. They're about to come. So this person, they seem to really be in their emotions at the moment. It's like kind of hard for them to control. I'm getting that this person, they're going to come and communicate with you. And they're going to literally express their love. And I just think 13, 13 when I said that. This person, they keep getting drawn to you, okay? So... There's this energy where they feel like they cannot forget you, to be honest. Um, I'm hearing Jenny. Let me know if that red name could be Jennifer. Um, but this person, they feel like they're never going to get over you. I'm kind of getting an energy where this person tried to get over you. But again, they feel like they can't. And again, this is somebody that they're not usually in their emotions at all I'm kind of getting when you met them they were very self-centered very self-absorbed um there's this energy of them kind of like being in their feelings and coming forward and expressing themselves to you Yeah, I am getting that this person, they're going to want to work on things, okay? You may work with this person, um, or you may have met them at work, um, but I do see this person wanting, they're taking a step forward, right? I do see them expressing their emotions. This person, they feel like they can't sleep at the moment. I'm getting this energy of them, especially if you're in, like, separation. I just think 1441. If you're in separation, they really want to come and make peace with you. Again, they can't sleep. They feel like, especially if you guys ended on bad terms, like, 
I'm getting with this person, they've been playing a whole lot of games and they're about to come and apologize, to be honest, right? Like, I'm getting that they're done with the games. Like, they're legit done with the games here. Um, they tried to play these mind games here with you. They tried to get into your head instead. They got into their own head, okay? This person tries to do things to get over you and to forget about you, but it doesn't seem to work at all. Um, they constantly think about you. They're having a very hard time, right? Now, this person also, they watch you maybe on social media or something. Um, but I do see this person not being able to let you go. And again, it's funny because this person, they started off trying to play games here with you, but now this person has genuine feelings for you. Feels like this person can't get over you, right? Kind of feels like... They feel like there's a spiritual connection here, okay? Um, whether you feel that way or not, but I'm kind of getting that... Whoever I'm speaking to, you seem to really embody divine and unconditional love, to be honest. So you may have a lot of people that feel a very strong soul connection to you. Because there's this unconditional love that you just have about you. You seem to love people unconditionally. You also seem to embody a very divine energy. So again, you may have a lot of people that seem to feel a strong soul connection to you. Could be dealing with strong Leo in this reading. Could be dealing with a Virgo. Could be dealing with a Cancer or a Taurus. Whoever this is, they're trying to manifest you, right? I'm getting that they may have been trying to manifest you for a long time. And they feel like they've worked really hard here for this. Um... But I'm getting this energy of them coming forward and expressing their emotions here. And again, this feels very out of character for this person, but they're definitely in their emotions at the moment. They also are very confused at how detached you are coming off, okay? For some of you, if this ends, um, a soul connection, I'm getting this energy of you kind of detaching, letting go of any type of control. And going with the flow, right? And this is kind of driving this person crazy, right? But I do see this person wanting to be genuine with you. Wanting to be honest. Wanting to have an honest conversation with you. Like, I'm getting that this person, they're done with the games. Right? Like, this person, there's this energy of... In the past, they were doing a lot. They were playing a lot of games, trying to get into your head. They also were they'd kind of this mean energy. Maybe they were a little bit mean to you. Or maybe you guys had a fight or something like that. Or they said something rude to you. Okay, but I do see this person. I see them being, like, very alone at the moment. Very upset. Like, they don't feel good enough. Again, there's this massive ego death that you have caused, okay? This was the type of person that literally thought that they could get whatever they wanted whenever they wanted um, by playing mind games with people, by confusing people, by manipulating people. And again, it kind of feels like you came and you put this person in their play, right? This is somebody as well that goes around and they try to get people to like fall in love with them or like you know, become obsessed with them. They try to do this with you, but I'm kind of getting that it's happened to them, right? Like, this person now is, like, obsessed with you and in love with you, right? So that's all I have for you. If it resonated, let me know. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next reading.